All right, Shalom. I want to start saying our praises to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem, Rakar Kadash. All right, double honors to our apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. All right, uh, peace and mercy be unto the Lord's elect out there teaching the word of truth city. All right, I'm the brother Amar. Got the brother Yahweh Sot with me. Shalom, Shalom. Shalom. All right, um, we was doing a real quick in transit, and uh, we was kind of talking before we got on camera. We just bought some stuff, and um, Spirit, you know, hopped on me just to kind of, you know, just put it on wax, as they say. But, um... Uh, we was kind of like it was talking about like pretty much like not wavering all right that was, that was kind of like you know kind of like what we were talking about but um and this and this and this and this latter days in the latter days pretty much when all hell really start to break break out because right now it ain't really it is not really bad i mean it's bad around the world like all together but it ain't really that fucked up to where you know the lord still got it to where you can still go to the store and get some drink you know you can still get some box you know what I mean? You can go to the lake, just chill out. You can still yeah. do things to where Esau's not on your ass, where you, you go on the checkpoints and so forth and so on. Yeah. Like, But it's going to get like that eventually. And you got to have, our faith got to be rock solid to a point where we're not wavering. You know what I mean? That's why I said, um, uh, like, when you look up the word wavering, it means like you you unsure. You know what I mean? You yeah. you know, you're not really, um, you're not, you, you, like, you're pretty much unsure. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so we're going to just kind of hop right into it. No. Yeah. Oh, so I can go ahead. Um, this is Book of James, and um, chapter one, verse starting at verse five. If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of Yahweh, while Yahweh shot. Keep going. That give of to all men liberally, and unbraideth not. Mm -hmm. Keep going. And it shall be given him. Keep going. Verse six. But let him ask in faith. Nothing wavering, Salakia. Mm -hmm. Nothing wavering. Right. So if you if you lack wisdom, all right, because um, and like like your your faith your faith can be like pretty much uh it can be it can be like it can be kind of like uh linked with your wisdom that you got. You know what I mean? Because the more wisdom you got, like the stronger your faith gonna be. You know what I mean? That's why that's why you look at our elders and stuff like that and brothers that have been in the truth like for a while. Like it's like they. They're, they're, they're like planted in the truth You know what I mean Like look at the elders And stuff like that Like they man You can't tell me <laughs> They not confident In what they God, believe in man God. Like they they for sure You wanna say something Yeah I mean not No no you, you but, 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 but God And I was just saying that With the video I was making Before you came and grabbed me mm -hmm. At the end of the day That's one of the Leadership traits That a leader is supposed to have Confidence, confidence. Yeah confidence That's yeah. what makes men follow confidence. So at the end of the day Like you said That was a beautiful point That you mm -hmm. made About the elders each one of the elders from Elder Jahar, mm -hmm. Elder Apostle Aramlab, mm -hmm. Elder Apostle um, Gabar, mm -hmm. and, and, and um, Elder Apostle um, Raha, mm -hmm. at the end of the day, when you watch their videos, you see the confidence in them. Kai. Yeah, Kai. Yeah, you good. So at the end of the day, that's all I wanted to say, like mm -hmm. you said, because at the end of the day, you see them very confident men, and that's what makes me and flock to them and follow them. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, because they, they they real they real bold in what they saying, and God. then they they back it up with scripture and, and hella uh, information. They edify you, you know, uh, nourish you. But uh, keep going on. This is uh, says for he that waver is like a wave of the sea driven with the wind and tossed. Right, you know what I mean. If you if you wavering, like I said, it's like you're you're not sure. You know what I mean. You you kind of. You straggling the fence, you know what I mean? You like, I don't, I don't really know. So in that in that day, man, it's like if you if you gonna be doing that shit, uh, and and the Jacob trouble, bro, you gonna you gonna be out of there. You know what I mean? Like imagine you imagine you having that mindset, you wavering, like with the chip. You know what I mean? It's like, like I'm, damn, I, I'm, I'm not I, sure. I, I'm not sure. Like I, I know the breakdown. I heard the breakdown. I know I know it say Karagma right there. You know decision and all that it's like you gonna you gonna you gonna if you doing that shit i'm telling you you gonna you gonna lose man no who do that a lot i mean speak on that a lot uh -huh. the, the, um, he don't like to be called elder the chief um gabar for men of dollar con, con, con. <laughs> he always he like <laughs> he's like oh you know straddling the fence like oh well i don't know and, yeah you know, and that's you got you got that's really just because you don't see it you got men that's in this thing that they yeah, like that, like that you know, yep. you know? and you can't have that mindset man because even when you like you look at like fights and stuff like that, or you just in a fight, uh -huh. if you if you if you kind of like not confident in like yo you know your moves and all that, like all right let me, and if you if you hesitating with like all right, let me uh -huh. throw that jab, let me throw that, it's like you got you, you it just you gotta you gotta understand like you gotta be confident in what you're doing and you gotta you can't waver with that man. 
Because the, the other dude, if he if he ain't wavering, he gonna get the upper hand on you. Kind of, not to digress, but like you said, like that was a beautiful analogy. Because mm-hmm. like you said, if you ever see somebody that that's confident, or when they done practice a move so many times, they they they, they move mm-hmm. and it's all more crisp. Yeah, when yep, the motherfucker's yep. scared, yep. They, you know, I mean, it's all sloppy. Yeah, yeah, they, yep, yep. And then and another thing, like you were sitting up there saying how um you know in this thing. You know, if you truly believe you're going to do the will and the work, you're going you're gonna to do what the example Yahweh Shah and the disciples mm-hmm. did. Uh-huh. So, I mean, talk is cheap. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. You know, action and belief is going, you're going to put action to it. You're going to actually be walking the walk. You're going to be doing, you're going to be doing the same thing. Exactly. Like that. The scriptures say, uh, I ain't going to get it though, but it say, uh, it's in Corinthians, it's either the first, first, or the, uh, First, the first, the first, first Corinthians, or Second Corinthians, we said, "As I, as I believe, therefore I speak." You know what I mean, so if you believe in this thing, you are gonna speak it. But you continue on. Right. Um, verse seven: For let not that man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord. Mm-hmm. Now, uh, jump down, jump down to twelve. Con, yeah, con. So lucky. Mm-hmm. Blessed is the man that endureth temptation, for when he is tried, he shall receive the crown of life, which. The Lord Yahweh, why Yahweh Shah, have promised to them that love Him. Right, because like I said, we was talking about uh, pretty much being um, like not wavering. You know what I mean? So in a, in a time of temptation, which is ultimately Revelation three and ten, which we ain't got to grab that. Uh, say uh, the, the, it speaks about the hour of temptation. Uh, so you gonna have to not waver in that day, man. You can't be. If you got, if you if you doing that shit now, like you've been in the truth for a couple years, you know what I mean, two three years or whatever, and you wavering, you don't, you ain't really sure, you don't really like going to camp and all that, you don't, you ain't really doing videos. That's you wavering. That's you wavering in your belief in your how about Shimmy Shine. You can't, you can't be doing that, man, because. You're not now. You're, you're not confident in your how your how why your how shot. You unsure about the word. Uh, the scriptures say America gonna get destroyed. It say Esau gonna push the chip. It say it say so forth and so on about the prophecies. And if you're wavering in those things, you gonna you gonna you can't you 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 uh you, you uh what's the word I'm looking for? You don't believe on the Most High pretty much. You know you don't believe on His word. You like I don't, I don't reach. I ain't really sure. They say that, but I don't know. Right. Well, uh, I'm gonna bring up this point because, like I said, you on that camp yesterday. I don't think you was following though, but I remember the brothers were sitting there talking about when you being spirit. Because basically, that's probably spirits or anything. Mm-hmm. But it's the, the most high so cold. Like I was just thinking about this. Like in this truth, you gonna fall short. Oh, yeah, but yeah, the yeah. most high so cold. Like I really like this is my first time actually about the Lord willing. Um, Experience the mm-hmm. Day of Atonement. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. At the end of the day, to show you how cold the Most High is, He gave you a day to, you know what I mean? Yeah, to, 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 to take that off of you. Exactly. So that's, I mean, like I said, now tell me that the Most High didn't think all this off. Uh-huh. Or, you know what I mean? That show you the, the power and the mm-hmm. omnipotence of mm-hmm. the Most High. Mm-hmm. At the end of the day, brothers were speaking on it yesterday at camp about how, you know, it's things you can do to try and get them deep. Because if you wavering in your faith, you got to, you know, a lot of elders speak on it as far as you got to fast, you know, pray more, read more, you know what I mean? But fast, and that fast can do a lot, they you know do, what I mean? Do. And the times, like you said, we were speaking on this, we coming in. A uh, brother, in my opinion, like, I try to fast at least once a week. Do I do it all the time? No. Mm-hmm. But, you know what I mean? You need to get into that mindset because it's going to be a day, like I say, we going to look up yeah. and you ain't going to be able to eat. You yeah, know what I mean? man. It's, it's going to get ugly, man. man like, we can't. That quick. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, you good, you good. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna get a real ugly out here, man. And that's why we can't uh we can't stress that point enough about Jake. Because the point of this topic is about not wavering. You uh-huh. know what I mean? You can't have that spirit of being doubtful. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, right. That's the good, water. Right. Yeah, doubtful, man. All right, but uh, the, which, uh, uh go to uh, get the, the Ephesians. Yeah, the one Ephesians. Oh, I, I got one more. Oh, yeah, go, no, go, like, you know, no I'm, a, I'm gonna get the Ephesians. Right, go. This book of Ephesians, um, chapter three, verse twelve. Mm-hmm. In whom? Well, you wanted me to start a different verse. Uh, yeah, I don't know. You, you can speak on it too, Hawk, if you want. So if you, you can jump up to the 11 or 12. You can just speak on it. This is chap, um, Ephesians 3. Um, I'm going to bring, start at verse 11. According to the eternal purpose which he purposed in Mashiach Yahweh Shai, mm-hmm. our Lord. Mm-hmm. Verse 12. In whom we have boldness and access with confidence by the faith of him. Oh, he's like, yeah, I can I uh, say no, so yeah, like, yeah. I'm giving it to you. I can, I'm gonna end it on one. Yeah, God. That see it say it's see who we have boldness and confidence in in how about Shimmy Al Shah. Bring it back one time, the last verse. Um, this is Ephesians 3 and 12. In whom we have boldness and access with confidence by the faith of him. 
That's it. Yo, it's like, yeah, by the faith of him, man. We have boldness and confidence by the faith of him. It's like I was expecting. No, you, you good. You <laughs> it's good. about the boldness and confidence and by the faith of him. And you got to have that. That goes back to what we just talked no, about. No, it's no, like, that's true. Yeah, exactly, bro. We just talking about that. The confidence and, and just the boldness in Yahweh shot and believing in what he said, man. You can't have that spirit of, like I said, the doubtfulness, man. And that's what that's what we getting, brothers. Um... Uh, uh, like, you know, when we at camp, that's what we getting. Some brothers, like, you know, they had that, um, that double mind, man. Kind, you know what I mean? They, ain't, they not eight, really, man. yeah, the James 1 and 8. They ain't really sure, you know what I mean? That's what scripture we brought earlier. That's, that, they ain't really sure, you know what I mean? It's like they, they question. It's like, bro, you've been in the truth for years. You got to know, man. Kind, kind, kind. We, we, and we might not be around each other in that day. And, and, the, and that's the spirit that you're speaking on. That. Just mm -hmm. like, for instance, like I said, like, when you really sit back and think about, it, like, we, you know what we're going through within our camp. But the point is, what we're speaking on within our camp. But, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, I don't think a lot of brothers know what you involved in. Like, I didn't yeah. know what I was involved yeah. in at first until I had to really sit and, like, wow, okay. Yeah. So, because, like I said, this ain't just going and putting on some fringes mm -hmm. and, and talking about I'm an Israelite and cussing out Edomites and mm -hmm. heathens and whatnot yeah, and, being, and rebuking and cussing Jake's out. Mm -hmm. No, this has. Repercussions with you know yeah, yeah. But it's not only Going to affect you mm -hmm. But those that you think You care about in the world mm -hmm. And all that mm -hmm. So I mean All I'm going to say Is brothers need to know What they What they what in into, yeah. Yeah. Apostle Gabor Always speaks about that man He said a lot of brothers They don't know What they got involved into Man you know, they heard, you know, what you probably heard the elders or seen right. brothers on YouTube and you liked it or whatever. Right. You know, you're like, oh, this is a new yeah, thing right, right now. Thing. <laughs> it's not the white man. Yeah, fuck the white man. Then it's like, they didn't understand, like, the gravity, like, the elder Taza Pa said. He, like, they don't understand the severity. Yeah, the severity. Uh, yeah. Real they like, you go on that word severity. Mm -hmm. This is severe. Yeah, I mean, is. you know what I mean? Like, what some of Seriously. the apostles had to. You know, um, suffer. You know what I mean? Yeah, that, that's not, that <laughs> when, when you read about the stories of our ancestors, man, they they caught holy hell from right. preaching the word. We doing the same thing. So if they call all that hell from preaching the word, you gotta put yourself in your shoes, man. It was severe. You catching it um, spiritually? We ain't caught the physical yet, right? You know but it's gonna happen soon. Uh, God. And you can see it coming. Um, mm -hmm. I don't yeah. know if you want to end this. No, this. You can get one. That last one. You this, about. this is the last one. This is the book of Philippians, mm -hmm. um, chapter one, verse twenty-five. And having this confidence, because at the end that we confident with this thing. That's why we do the will and work of Yahweh while Yahweh shot. Right, right. I know that I shall abide and continue with you, Lord willing. Mm -hmm. I shall abide and continue with you all for your furtherance and joy of the faith. Huh. Hey, and, and that was and that was that was the point, huh? You know what I mean? If we got we got this confidence, they said we're gonna continue with what? With, with the um with you all for your furtherance and joy of the faith. Right. So, so we're we gonna keep on pushing this word. Yeah, yeah man. So, yeah. So so the brothers can get it, you know what I mean? So we can hopefully get the fuck up out of this place, God, man. God. So you know, hey, with that we're gonna give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakar Kadash. All right, double honors to our apostles, Elder Great Millstone. All right, peace and mercy be unto the Lord's elect. All right, Baba Ball. Shalom. Shalom, my Baba Ball. Kan Kan.